morning and welcome in. As you can see, the sun is shining right in my face right now, but that's okay. At least we got sunshine. Well, I guess sometimes we need rain too, but uh, yeah, it's a beautiful morning. I'm about an hour away from my delivery place right now. Got me a reload already, so hopefully I can uh, do a quick unload and uh, head over to my reload place because they're only open till 3 o'clock according to the satellite message that sent me. So, uh, yeah, so it's uh, looking like it's going to be another weekend home. That's going to be great. I like, I think I had four weekends in a row where I was on the road and uh, Looks like I'm, the I'm on the road to uh, get me at least a couple of weekends in a row at home, so that's good. It's going to be my third weekend at home, it looks like. Which I'm very excited to have, because uh, like during the week you can't really spend time with friends or anything like that. So, uh, guess what? My son has got a birthday coming up this, uh, this month. So we'll probably have a birthday party for him on the weekend, so that's going to be nice. Probably have some nice barbecue and stuff like that, so uh, looking forward to doing that. Yeah! But uh, anyways, we are rolling, putting the hammer down, got a little bit of hills. But that's alright, not too bad at least. At least there's not snow yet. Anyways, we'll see what the day will bring us today. Now this is something you don't see every day. People on horses. That's how I grew up. We had a horsey and buggy back in Bolivia. I'm just about two miles away from a delivery place, but I just thought that was quite interesting. Speed level uh, reduced to half. Usually don't see that uh, very often anymore. People riding on horses. I, I've done that myself. I love it. It's a lot of fun, especially if you can go with a group like that, you know. But anyways, I'll go deliver my load and we'll be back later. Man, I'm telling you, it's nice and green up here compared to at home. Going to another uh, In 900 feet, town. turn left on I-55 BR and then turn right in 350 Beautiful. feet. Balls, bones. Turn left on I-55 BR, and then turn right in 350 feet. Yep. Turn left on Washington Street, the truck then turn right. All right. That's a good sign. All right. All right. Okay, looks like the car is going to stop, so all right. Turn right on I-55 Branch. Turn right on I-55 BR. Uh all these tight corners but uh, oh well should be back on the main road here pretty soon yep now yeah, well thank you sir for pulling to the side continue point four miles Many then turn left on that. i 55 branch Stop sign. Right. Here we are. Okay, looks like everybody's got to stop. Got a nice memorial here on the right. Here we go. Oh, look at this. This is always interesting to my wife. The cement truck up here. It always looks like they're driving backwards. Well, tell me something. Isn't this something beautiful? I like it. Going through the bushes like this. Seeing a nice nature forest. I love that. Beautiful colors of the trees, you know. It's just something I enjoy. Steep down great ahead. I hope you guys enjoy it too. A little windy road, but yeah well, some places you just have to travel these roads, you know. Anyways, just figure I show this a little bit to you guys areas that we travel in. Well, let's just take a look at this. We got, uh, I'm not sure what you would call it, lake, river, I'm not sure, flooding area, but you got some water on both sides of the highway. Got a nice little bridge over it. They're doing some, cons 
construction here right now it looks like but uh, yeah it's uh, this is always interesting to me you know you got a, low, a big flood area or whatever you want to call it got all kinds of trees in there yeah it's been a good day so far for me just finished my day here a little while ago uh, fueled up went inside took me a shower which wasn't a good experience I much rather not have taken that shower uh, the water was so cold I mean uh, I couldn't couldn't really handle it but uh, oh well what are you gonna do it's the flying J here just south of uh, Kansas City I guess you could call it on the uh, US 71 so if it's real busy don't take a shower down here man it's uh, eh, it's not worth your money I mean that was the worst shower I've ever had it was so cold that water I mean it was ice cold I, it's, it's, so I couldn't I, I don't know it definitely wasn't worth the money so anyways that's all I'm gonna say for today finished uh, picking up my load earlier I'm on my way home so I should be home on Saturday sometime so uh, with that we'll uh, we'll cut it for today and we'll see you tomorrow again thanks for watching